on the rugged cliffs of a forsaken Irish village. Where the winds howled like tormented spirits, there lived a family with a cursed lineage. The O'Malleys were well acquainted with the legends of the Banshee, a harbinger of death whose mournful wails foretold imminent tragedy. Bridget O'Malley, the youngest daughter of the family, had always been drawn to the mysterious tales that echoed through the village. The elders spoke of an otherworldly presence that haunted the moors, a specter known for its chilling screams that heralded the impending doom of those cursed to hear it. One fateful evening, as the sun dipped below the horizon, casting long shadows over the craggy landscape, Bridget heard a faint but haunting melody carried by the evening breeze. She dismissed it as a trick of the wind, but a sense of unease settled in her bones. As the night deepened, the mournful wails grew louder, weaving through the quiet village streets. Bridget, unable to resist the call, followed the ghostly sound. The villagers shuttered their windows, unwilling to confront the omen that echoed through the night. The chilling wails led Bridget to the ancient graveyard overlooking the sea, where tombstones stood like silent watchers in the pale moonlight. The air was thick with an otherworldly energy as Bridget saw a spectral figure, shrouded in mist, with flowing silver hair and eyes that glowed like phosphorescent embers. The spectral figure's gaze met Bridget's, and an unspeakable sorrow overcame Bridget. The wail ceased, leaving an oppressive silence in their wake. Bridget, transfixed, watched as the figure extended a spectral hand, pointing towards the village below. A sinking feeling gripped Bridget's heart as she realized the Banshee's visit was not a mere legend, but a dire warning. Panic set in, and she raced back to the village the echoes of the Banshee's cries haunting her every step. Days turned to nights, and an air of trepidation settled over the O'Malley household. Whispers of the Banshee's visit spread through the village, and the O'Malley's lived in the shadow of impending doom. One stormy night, as the winds howled through the cliffs, the O'Malley patriarch fell gravely ill. Bridget, burdened by the weight of the Banshee's prophecy, watched helplessly as the specter's wails returned with an eerie intensity, filling the air with an otherworldly lament. The following morning, the village awoke to the news of the patriarch's passing. The Banshee's curse had claimed another victim, and Bridget, forever changed by the spectral encounter, understood the ancient warnings that had echoed through generations. The cliffs, forever haunted by the mournful cries, were witness to the tragedies that unfolded beneath the watchful eyes of the spectral harbinger. The village, now a place of quiet mourning, whispered tales of the O'Malley family's curse, a reminder that some legacies were eternally bound to the echoes of the Banshee's chilling cries.